I have not had many IT platforms or projects roll out where I have users just randomly stop me and thank me. Um, but the ZPA rollout was one of those. My name's Eric Fisher. I work with Growmark, which is a large national agricultural cooperative. We have operations all over the country, and we really do power a lot of the larger agricultural markets in the United States. Our big goal here for our company is to give ourselves maximum flexibility, and that's why we're really a cloud-first and mobile-first shop. We thought that having our um, assets in the most powerful cloud platform on the planet, in AWS, um, partnering with ZPA to get our users securely to that environment was really, really critical. We're getting a better security uh, footprint, we get better visibility, we're more compliant to a number of things that we were targeting, and it's easier on our admins, which is a really big deal because, again, finding high-quality um, security staff is tough. Um, I think that's tough for everybody. When it came to the SAP deployment and operations, you know, we've been a very, very happy AWS customer there, SAP. Um, we get some design capabilities there with SAP running on AWS infrastructure that we just can't, we can't do ourselves and, and nobody else really can either um, that we can see. Um, performs excellent. Let's us do things like patching forward, our failovers across um, availability zone. And what we found specifically with ZPA is that it's very tolerant of poor connectivity. And given our rural footprint, again, we have over 500 locations spread through what I consider some of the toughest markets to find good connectivity in. When COVID hit, we just went home. We, we didn't come into the office the next day. And our biggest issue with COVID was really how many monitors does staff get to take home? We're very, very happy with Zscaler. We're very, very happy with AWS. Two big partners for us that have enabled us to um, securely deploy into the cloud um, at scale and give us a position that we have a lot of flexibility to uh, do things like acquisitions, um, build and, and deploy additional workloads into the cloud. Um, and really future-proof us, if that's possible in IT, uh, to be in the best position possible going forward for the business and their, their operations and growth.